So we, when we were starting Minitis as a layer two, we wanted to uh, design it the way that it would be decentralized mm -hmm. with the many sequencers, so many computers mm -hmm. saving these transactions on Ethereum. Mm -hmm. And therefore, if like one of the computers or uh, some of the computers go down or, you know, uh, they, the network will still be up because they just all take mm -hmm. in turns. And that's what Mitis is providing right now, exactly that network mm -hmm. that is always up, that is very cheap. Uh, at the same time, it's fast. on Ethereum, very fast, mm -hmm. very cheap, and always up and completely decentralized. So that's why I would choose Mitis. Mirei Don, I'm going to talk to you about the future of Mitis. 나탈리아 아멜린 그리고 엘레나 스넬리코바 모시고 이야기 들어보겠습니다. Executives, so what is the Metis next step, like next goal in the huge support from this community? Mm -hmm. um, yes, so uh, as I said, we just deployed Alpha Network with mm -hmm. the first decentralized sequencer. So now uh, there will be um, liquid staking providers that come in onto the network that will be paired up with the decentralized sequencers. And uh, each decentralized sequencer in a couple of uh, liquid staking provider will be uh, staking MITIS to secure the network and uh, this, the whole um, uh, decentralized network will start working. With that, uh, we also uh, have this existing development grant that's right now half a billion uh, dollars yeah. that is uh, giving grants mm -hmm. to great applications that come in over. And right now, so we have uh, lots of new DEXs that are uh, innovative DEXs that are coming over. Uh, gaming companies, mm -hmm. uh, liquidity, stick liquidity provider, liquidity staking providers, uh, social FI, DeFi applications. And they um, going to they, they are deploying on Mitis, and therefore we're going to have kind of the growth of the whole ecosystem. Mm -hmm. So together with decentralized sequencers uh, providing security and staking for the network, we also have the development of the user base and the transactions uh, and the whole ecosystem going up. Um, just would like to add to that that uh, you know we are um, only at the beginning of the decentralization journey as far as sequencer is concerned, and uh, we launched our alpha network with just a few sequencers. So our, some other next steps that we're going to have is obviously we would like to decentralize more. So we are going to gradually add more and more sequencers so that, you know, this, they decentralize from the geographical standpoint, from technology standpoint. That's very important to us because um, we want to make sure that we are as decentralized as possible. So adding more sequencers is uh, also will be something we'll be focusing in the near future. Mm -hmm. So we are calling for the new um, node providers, for the experienced node providers mm -hmm. to uh, come and apply to be uh, to become a sequencer mm -hmm. and our community will vote for the best okay so in recently metis launched its on dx like Her hercules uh, Her Her hercules hercules yes. yes and it offered a very attractive apr and garnered a lot of interest in korean um, cryptocurrency market so how was the performance of hercules mm -hmm. Well, yeah, I'm not surprised that the, it gained such uh, following yeah. already mm -hmm. uh, because Hercules is a friendly fork of the Camelot system mm -hmm. uh, and, and the Camelot um, helped to actually build and launch uh, uh, this DEX on, um, on Metis. Uh, so Hercules is uh, using the innovative technology of uh, sticky, li sticky liquidity mm -hmm. and uh, therefore it is, has lots of prospects. So it was not launched by Mitis. It was launched at Mitis. Mm -hmm. Of course, Hercules is its own team, mm -hmm. but Mitis uh, Foundation uh, provided grant mm -hmm. for this DEX. So this, this, is, this is the relationship. Mm -hmm. uh, we see lots of prospects in this project, mm -hmm. but of course, you will need to do your homework and see, uh, follow Hercules on X mm -hmm. <laughs> and all other yeah. social media and see what it's up to so not to miss the opportunity. Okay, so okay, um, and in the end, what's, what's important is the composition of organic ecosystem. And, and there was an also 
plan to expand the ecosystem with the recent recent fund launch. So was there any success of fund you guys on the launch? So in terms of, you know, be, creating the successful ecosystem, um, I think uh, are some of the key things that we need to focus, uh, uh, that we will be focusing on is, uh, on, and that's what I'm specifically excited at Midas, is that um, from, the, from the beginning, the design was to um, create a platform that supports the ecosystem, right? And um, launching decentralized sequencers is a first step and not just towards decentralization, but also to uh, so further uh, reward an ecosystem for being part of, um, with us on the Meta's journey, right? So because um, decentralized sequencers gives an opportunity to share the revenue with the community. So instead of one single corporation collecting all the uh, transaction revenue, it's that uh, we're actually sharing it with a larger community. And uh, that is uh, one of the um, things that we believe we need to focus to keep community engaged. One of the problems that we see with some communities, right, it's apathy. So you join community, you kind of do something with it, and then you just uh, stop. And uh, maybe you have some governance tokens, but, you know, whenever there is a proposal to vote for something, you don't care. So we want to create a different paradigm where there is an incentivization system in place to keep everyone engaged. And everyone interested. And we're providing this opportunity not only for the infrastructure providers, for the, but the, for the community at large, because anyone can actually contribute into security of the network and, of course, receive the uh, reward on that through liquid staking providers. And because um, uh, that infrastructure will be uh, staking METIS, uh, the, the, the value of the ecosystem uh, will grow exponentially and uh, also so so the rewards for for people so that's what we aim for uh, as per the grants uh, the, the grants that we announced uh, we already gave grants to uh, multiple projects mm -hmm. of course hercules is one of them as i mentioned we have artemis uh, that received the the grant so we also have defy kingdoms uh, defy kingdom is the gaming applications, mm -hmm. so they are building the PvP activity, okay. <laughs> yes, like yeah, the PvP modules, uh, so the, the lots of transactions are going to come uh, onto Mitis via this one. Uh, we have a WAGMI uh, that is uh, also get got a grant, mm -hmm. so I, I cannot probably remember right now all, all mm -hmm. of the uh, dApps that got the grant, lot, but right? like, it was, it's a lot, so it was quite a few that receive the grant and deploying and working already. And there is also a big lineup of uh, those who applied and we're in the process of evaluating, of course, because uh, we also want to be careful. The process for getting a grant is not straightforward in terms of if you apply, does uh, applying does not guarantee getting the grant, right? We're looking at the quality of applicants, quality of projects, and uh, those who we see brings the most value to the system, go first and receive the funding. What role will the Mitis token play within the ecosystem? Uh, yes, <laughs> of course, when we plan a Mitis, we plan it to be decentralized. Mm -hmm. uh, with the role of a Mitis token to, to be a holy trinity of utility. Uh, one token for gas, mm -hmm. governance, and also to secure the network through decentralized sequencers, through stake in decentralized sequencers. This is, this the model provide as ability first to increase the whole uh, value of the ecosystem and empower it through the token. Mm -hmm. uh, and that is also allowed us to you know, build this decentralization that is safe and secure. Many Koreans are now having an interest in Mitis ecosystem. So how can they participate in Mitis community? Mitis? In many ways, depends on what their goals are, right? So um, if they are builders, um, we, as we were saying, we launched the ecosystem development fund designed for builders to uh, integrate with our network. So apply for the grant, um, come and join. Uh, if you are infrastructure provider, of course, if, uh, if you have experience, uh, apply to become one of the sequencer nodes. 
that's um, also a very attractive proposition, participate in the uh, sequence of revenue sharing, right? If you are a liquidity provider, again, we'll have a great opportunity to be um, participate in the ecosystem, to be paired up with the um, uh, with, with the nodes, infrastructure nodes, uh, sequence of nodes, sorry, and um, earn your rewards this way as well. If you are just a user, uh, of course, the, uh, there will be more and more opportunities in the DeFi, in social fi, um, NFTs, gaming, so you can explore communities this way. And uh, if you're just a bystander who is curious, um, you can just uh, open our website, read our blog, and uh, learn about the ecosystem. And learn about which way you would like to participate, yes, because right now, with the decentralized sequencer, uh, the, the staking of Mitis token will be available to stake for security, uh, for the security of the network, not just, um, you know, DeFi APY, but actually to secure the network, and that's, that's the real utility. But there are also uh, DeFi opportunities, there are opportunities, gaming opportunities, mm -hmm. um, th there are opportunities uh, to, to, to participate in social fi, so we have uh, friends, um, leak tech, leak tech, <laughs> leak tech that, that also is launching social fi, so you can participate in the social media. Mm -hmm. uh, there are also, we have an Econode uh, queries, for example, that you can, if you're an influencer, you could participate in influencer marketing and also do it this way. So there are lots and lots of ways. You can go to the Mitis.io website mm -hmm. and learn about it. Uh, you can also uh, hit uh, Mitis uh, team at X, Mitis layer two, Mitis L2 at X mm -hmm. uh, and ask the questions on Telegram. So we have Mitis L2 Telegram as well. So you can ask there. There are lots of opportunities to participate. And finally, if you are interested in becoming part of the Mitis team, Right. Uh, the good opportunity, the good uh, way to do, to go about it is maybe start as uh, part of our community development team. Uh, we have our representative here, Christine and uh, Christine Choi, and um, we are looking for people who will be excited about what Mitis has to offer and sharing our passion with the community and helping us to grow in Korea. So let's talk about uh, market. So as you two are expert and worked in this industry for a long time, so how do you see the future about um, cryptocurrency market this year? Because many people are expecting for like a bull market these days. So how do you guys see the market? It's, <laughs> it's a million dollar question. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and uh, I wish we, we knew the future, mm -hmm. uh, then of course we, we could tell you. Mm -hmm. uh, from my experience, market right now in this kind of warming up phase, mm -hmm. because we see lots of uh, activities from investors, so we're judging from um, in, in, uh, investor activity that invests into the ecosystem projects, and we see lots of interest and interest going up. Uh, so it's definitely not a bear market, mm -hmm. but I cannot say that it's like it's a it's a bull bull market okay. yet. So mm -hmm. this is probably the beginning. That would be my assessment. But again, do your own research. So don't rely on my words okay. because I'm just a human being yeah. and I don't know the future. I cannot predict mm -hmm. it. And you know, in this uh, this year so far, it's already been quite a run, right? So we started the year, and uh, you know, if we look at the prices, um, we almost doubled the price already on um, Ethereum, for example, right? So um, it's already been a very successful year. I think people um, may be entering the market and um, expecting, you know, oh, I'm going to do my thousand X on something, but you know, um, yes, it's possible. But you also need to be careful because it can go other ways. The thing is, when you are in a, in, in a cryptocurrency space, if you are in a Bitcoin, um, the opportunity for um, you can you can lose money, but opportunity for it to for Bitcoin to fall hard and low is significantly less than for some meme coin. Um, then you, you just need to everyone just need to have uh, act according to their risk tolerance and uh, be responsible player in the market. Okay. okay, thank you. So to close the interview, say goodbye or for Korean subscribers or of, to, the, to the camera, please. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's uh, my first time in Korea and uh, 
my observation is that the community here is amazing. I see the people have true interest in blockchain. Um, I was noticing today, reflecting on, uh, as Alina was speaking, how many people were taking pictures, taking notes. It just shows us that how people care and how they want to learn and understand and be part of it. And that is very rewarding to be here and being part of this community because of that. So I'm hoping that uh, your interest is just, um, you know, starting and it's going to grow exponentially and that we will be working with many of you um, and you become part of our Mitis community. Thank you very much. Thank you. Okay. 미래의 돈을 만나보는 시간 퓨처 머니. 지금까지 매티스의 나탈리아 그리고 엘레나 만나봤습니다. 다음번에 또 만나요. 안녕. 안녕. 떠봐.